Hi, I'm Lauren Rivers, and I realize it's been a while since I've made a vlog, so apologies for the silence, but it's been a long story. Anyway, suffice it to say that I'm working on it, and I'm doing all right. Uh, for now, I guess the most recent news report is that last weekend we were at Midwest Fur Fest. I was planning to make a brief vlog before then, but that didn't work out. Anyway, we stayed with our usual favorite roommates, Angel and Northpaw, who of course are always the best roommates we could honestly ask for. And you know, Midwest Fur Fest this year happened to be the first furry convention ever to break 10,000 furries, which is a lot of people. And you know, I mean, the con was great for the most part. We had a good time. It was a little bit crowded at points, but you know, the only real negative I would have to say would be the reg line, which we were on the reg line 3.5 hours with pretty much no idea that's how long we would be waiting. Now, I've realized it's a huge con with a bunch of people to to sign in, but at the moment, like a friend of mine said, there's no benefit to pre-registering right now. You're going to spend the same amount of time, and some people that registered at the door got in faster, supposedly. Either way, I was at a con with a lot more people for uh, Star Trek over the summer, and there was no reg line. Now, I realize that was a corporate-run con, but even still, there has to be something done about the process, because... You know, spending 3.5 hours on a line, that just isn't an option for some people. And it's kind of crazy because, you know, if they told me that it was going to be that long, I would have come back. And I really think that the crowd control really should have been perhaps better informed on relaying information to people, things of that nature. Uh, so we had our annual tradition at the end of the con of going to Porcello's. So our group, uh, the Cool Kids Table, all met up there and had a really excellent meal. I always like going there because, you know, to me, it's the real start of the holiday season. I mean, once we go there with the Christmas decorations and everything, I mean, that's when the holidays start for me. And yeah, a Angel was was our, our leader and our host, and she did a wonderful job of, uh, of delivering a, a speech, which I will post on this channel at some point. Um, we got our Christmas tree up after we came back. We didn't do it before we left, mostly because we have a couple of cats, and we really didn't trust them to leave the tree alone for the five days while we were gone. Otherwise, I would have done it after Thanksgiving. You know, had MFF still been at his old time slot right before Thanksgiving, you know, we would have done it the day after. But, you know, it didn't take too long, and I'm working on a holiday video this year, which, you know, hopefully this month I'll get my act together and I'll get back on track. So I'm working on it. And just because I want to be nerdy, I'm just going to say that, uh, you know, at being an adult, I am totally, I totally spent $200 on spaceships because I can. So, you know, uh, yay, Eagle Moss. And I guess that's it for right now. There will probably be some news later. Hopefully it won't be quite as long since until the next update, but I will see you guys around. Thanks for watching. And if you liked it, click the subscribe button and leave a comment below. You can also find me on Twitter and a few other places on the web or support me via Patreon or Ko-fi. Zebra hugs!